very interesting question we have question number eight you can see here find the equation of a straight line passing through the centroid here we have a centroid of the triangle it means three points are given three vertices are given of a triangle one two three before uh, starting before finding the equation of line we have to find out centroid of a triangle and after that number one parallel to the line we have to find out equation which is parallel to this line and again in number two also same we have to find out equation of a straight line which is perpendicular to this line okay so parallel also given perpendicular also given so before is finding parallel and perpendicular lines we have to find out centroid of the triang uh, triangle yes so let's start question number eight uh, given vertices of triangle are three vertices are here so you can write uh, x1 y1 or directly also you can write doesn't matter x1 y1 is equal to 3 minus 4 x2 y2 is equal to this we have to assume only minus 2 1 and x3 y3 is equal to 5 0 okay up to here we have a centroid uh, of a triangle now we have to find out centroid now centroid of the triangle we have a formula of centroid hope you know this formula centroid x y is equal to x1 plus x2 plus x3 by 3 similarly uh, here is no place so uh, i'm writing small y1 plus y2 plus y3 by 3 so x1 plus x2 plus x3 by 3 y1 plus y2 plus y3 by 3 now just we have to put the values and we get here the value of x y or centroid you can say now x1 x2 x3 x1 3 x2 minus 2 x3 5 so we can write here 3 minus 2 plus 5 by 3 similarly y1 y2 y3 y1 4 minus 4 minus 4 plus 1 plus 0 by 3 after this just we have to calculate uh, here we get 1 plus 5 6 by 3 and this side we get minus 3 by 3 and when you calculate this we get 2 minus 1 so centroid of the triangle is uh, 2 minus 1 let's look at number 1 now in number 1 what is here mm, parallel to this we have to find out equation of line which is parallel to this so what we have to write any line parallel to any line parallel to which line here given x minus 3y minus 4 is equal to 0 question 1 is any line parallel to this line is equal to what what i told you before we have to write this same so x minus 3y we have to write on same just in the place of minus 4 what we have to write plus k is equal to 0 equation 2 now this equation is passing from the centroid according to question you can see here find the equation of this straight line passing through the centroid so passing through this point 2 minus 1 so in the place of x we have to write 2 in the place of y we have to write down minus 1 and we get value of k again we have to put the value of k here you will get equation equation 1 is passing through centroid centroid means 2 minus 1 2 minus 1 so in the place of x write on 2 2 minus 3 in the place of y we have to write on minus 1 plus k is equal to 0 2 minus minus plus 3 plus k is equal to 0 so here we get k is equal to or one step more we can write here 5 plus k is equal to 0 and k is equal to minus 5 uh, we got here now we have to put the value of k in equation 2 hence the required equation is required equation is x minus 3y minus 5 is equal to 0 Th this is required equation of line parallel to this line okay 
in the place of k in k is equal to minus 5 just in the place of k we have to write down minus 5 x minus 3y in the place of k we have to write minus 5 hence the required is the equation is this now we have to do number 2 also perpendicular 1 okay equation is same given any line perpendicular cooler to x minus 3y minus 4 is equal to 0 is which line any line perpendicular to this is equal to what for what we have to do we have to interchange the coefficient of x and y here we have to write 3 and in the place of 3 we have to write on 1 here is nothing than 1 and in the place of minus what we have to write plus we have to change the sign also and at last we have to write on k so what we have to write here 3x plus y plus k is equal to 0 again listen we have to change the coefficient here is 1 here is 3 so we have to interchange this 3 we have to write here and 1 we have to write here and in the place of minus we have to write plus if here is plus we have to write down minus and at last always we have to write plus k not minus k always plus k and this equation 3 because 1 2 already here so write down here 3 now equation 3 equation 3 passes through centroid of the triangle centroid of the triangle what is the coordinate of centroid uh, we have 2 minus 1 so 2 minus 1 so now what we have to do we have to put the value of x y in this equation and we get here so so in the place of x what we have to write 2 3 into 2 in the place of y we have to write on 1 plus k is equal to 0 and here 3 to the 6 minus 1 plus k is equal to 0 5 plus k is equal to 0 and k is equal to minus 5 again we get here minus 5 so at last we have to write hence the required equation is hence the required equation is this one is for perpendicular so in the place of k what we have to write minus 5 we can write here 3x plus y and in the place of k we have to write minus 5 is equal to 0 which is required equation of perpendicular line today we done for parallel also perpendicular also hope you understand this one is for parallel if parallel what we have to write this and this we have to write on same just in the place of minus 4 we have to write plus k but if perpendicular then what we have to do we have to interchange the coefficient this 3 we have to write front and here 1 we have to write back and in the place of minus we have to write plus and in the place of this we have to write on k like parallel only uh, hope you understand this question number 8 uh, which is uh, related with parallel and perpendicular line and uh, if you understand this video please hit the like button and if you are new on my channel please subscribe and press the bell button so you will get the notification of upcoming videos and, and this whole week i will do coordinate geometry only so if you have any question please visit on my description like my facebook page and facebook group and you can send message or your question in facebook page or facebook group so i will bring uh, i will solve that question as soon as possible and upload on my youtube channel thanks for watching till last have a great day